Actress Elk Somber gained recognition early in her career, but it was her role in Name of the Movie that truly defined her trajectory in the industry. Which of her legendary works do you think shaped her career the most? We're eager to hear your thoughts and memories in the comments below. Stay tuned because we'll be revealing some funny, shocking, and sad facts about her life. So keep watching this video. Born in 1940 in Berlin, Germany, Elk Somber grew up in a humble household amidst the challenges of World War II. Despite the hardships, her family persevered. Showing a strong interest in arts and culture from a young age, she caught the eye of talent scouts after winning a beauty contest in her late teens. Initially, her career consisted of minor roles in German films. However, her talent and charisma soon gained attention, leading to opportunities in Hollywood. She found her breakthrough in the 1960 film The Magnificent Rogue, which propelled her to international fame. Throughout her career, she showcased her versatility in various roles, ranging from comedy to drama. Audiences were captivated by her charm and elegance, making her a sought-after leading lady. Despite the challenges of being a foreign actress in Hollywood, she persisted and achieved success in the film industry. Her journey was shaped by significant events, including her upbringing in post-war Germany, her early success in beauty pageants, and her determination to succeed in the competitive world of film. These experiences molded her into a notable actress. Elk Somber earned a Golden Palm Star on the Palm Springs Walk of Stars in 2001. She resides in Los Angeles, California, where she pursues her passion for painting, heavily influenced by Mark Chagall. Her portrayal of Maria Gambrelli in A Shot in the Dark marked a significant career milestone. Sommer had prior commitments to two German films, but opted to use $100,000 from her fee to exit those contracts, allowing her to sign a three-year deal with MGM. Her dedication to her craft and her willingness to make strategic career decisions have solidified her place in the entertainment industry. In A Shot in the Dark, Maria Gambrelli, played by Elk Somber, made a memorable debut, leaving an indelible mark on cinematic history. Her performance set a standard for portraying the charming yet enigmatic character. However, in Son of the Pink Panther, Claudia Cardinale took on the role with her unique flair. Elk Somber's performance earned her a nomination for the prestigious 1975 Joseph Jefferson Award. Her role in Born Yesterday at Drury Lane Theatre North in Chicago, Illinois, impressed critics and audiences. It showcased her talent and versatility as an actress. Beyond the screen, Elk Somber's family ties add another layer to her story. She is connected to Gutty Summer and marries a Somber, both winning the 1974 Miss Universe title for Brazil. This family bond emphasizes the talent within the Somber lineage. In film history, Elk Somber's portrayal of Maria Gambrelli remains a standout moment, demonstrating her ability to bring characters to life authentically. Her impact on cinema continues to be celebrated and remembered, highlighting her legacy. During the 1960s and 1970s, the actress Elk Somer appeared in several notable issues of Playboy magazine. Her pictorials were featured in the magazines September 1964, December 1967, and September 1970 issues. During that time, while living in Beverly Hills with her then-husband Joe Hyams, they experienced strange events in their home, leading them to believe it was haunted. In the film The Prize, Somber played the role of Inga Lisa Anderson, a character known for navigating unexpected challenges. Another noteworthy film in her career was A Shot in the Dark, which included scenes set in nudist camps, a unique feature not often seen in movies, and a testament to her versatility as an actress. Her involvement in these films, along with her appearances in Playboy, showcased her ability to engage audiences in different ways. Her impact on cinema and popular culture remains significant, ensuring her place in the entertainment industry's history. Elk Somber, known for her roles in A Shot in the Dark and The Wrecking Crew, now spends about half the year touring in plays around Europe and America. In A Shot in the Dark, she portrayed Maria Gambrelli. Interestingly, as of February 2022, she is the last surviving cast member of the film. In The Wrecking Crew, she played Linka Kerensky. It's worth noting that the characters she and Nigel Green portrayed in this film had the exact same relationship and character trajectory as characters they played in a British movie made only the year before, deadlier than the male. This film was a reboot of the 1930s Bulldog Drummond detective series into a 1960s James Bond Matt Helm secret agent character and format. Elk Somber, known for her role in films and as a former beauty queen, 
first caught the eye of director Vittorio De Sica in 1958 when she won the title of Miss Viareggio during a holiday in Italy. This moment marked the beginning of her journey into the world of acting. In 1964, a film producer discovered her talent while she was appearing in a British film. This led her to move to Hollywood, where she has since resided. Sommer's transition to Hollywood was significant, solidifying her presence in the film industry. One of her notable appearances was as a host alongside Bob Barker for the 1981 Miss Universe pageant. This event showcased her versatility beyond acting as she took on the role of a host for an international event. Throughout her career, Sommer has demonstrated her adaptability and skill, making her a recognizable figure in both the entertainment industry and beauty pageants. Elk Sommer, daughter of a Lutheran minister, faced early loss when her father passed away when she was just 14. Despite this, she went on to establish herself in the film industry. In 1975, her role in Carry On Behind earned her £30,000, making her one of the highest paid actors in the film series alongside Phil Silvers. This starkly contrasted with Kenneth Williams, who received only £5,000 for his role. Sommer's career wasn't without personal challenges. She suffered three miscarriages during her marriage to Joe Hyams. Despite setbacks, Elk Sommer's talent and determination propelled her forward in the entertainment world. In the wake of Joe Dunn's passing on January 14, 2022, Elk Sommer is now the sole surviving cast member of A Shot in the Dark. She's had a long and varied career, facing both highs and lows. In 1960, she was up for the lead female role in G.I. Blues, a movie starring Elvis Presley, but lost out to Juliet Prowse. Despite this setback, she didn't give up, and she made her mark in the entertainment world. She's best known for her comedy roles, which she finds both exciting and challenging. She loves comedy because it's so diverse, always presenting new ways to make people laugh. Her talent for bringing humor to her performances has made her a beloved figure in entertainment. With each new role, she captures audiences' attention all over again, whether she's on screen or stage. People love her not just for her talent, but also because she genuinely loves what she does. As she continues to entertain audiences, Elk Sommer's impact remains strong, reminding us how art can inspire and uplift us. This is the story of a woman who has left a lasting impression on countless fans worldwide. Elk Sommer's journey is one of resilience, creativity, and boundless laughter, showing us the enduring power of art to touch our lives. At 17, Elk Sommer studied languages with the intention of becoming an interpreter. To improve her English, she came to London Following her participation and success in a German beauty contest, she earned a screen test that led to her involvement in five German films and six Italian films. In August 1960, she arrived in the UK for Don't Bother to Knock, and inspired by her character, recorded a cha-cha number. In a shot in the dark, Elk Somber played Maria Gambrelli. Clauso complimented her perfume twice, but she clarified that it was bath oil. This scenario was also present in her previous film, The Prize, where she explained the same to Andrew Craig. Elk Sommer's journey began with language studies and a beauty contest leading to numerous film projects in Germany and Italy before her arrival in the UK. Her portrayal of Maria Gambrelli in A Shot in the Dark showcased her ability to captivate audiences, leaving a mark that echoed in her previous work. The recurring theme of explaining her perfume as bath oil in different films adds a distinctive touch to her characters. Elk Sommer, a German actress, survived a nearly fatal accident while filming a stunt for a movie. She suffered severe injuries, including a broken back, but remarkably recovered and continued her acting career with determination. She gained fame in the 1960s for her roles in various films, showcasing her talent and versatility. Sommer could play different characters from funny to serious, impressing audiences with her acting skills. Despite facing personal and professional challenges, she remained strong and kept acting. Her dedication and perseverance made her respected in the entertainment world. Throughout her career, her performances left a lasting impression on audiences worldwide. Besides acting, she also wrote and painted, showing her talents beyond movies. Her work in the film industry is still celebrated today, reminding us of her influence as an actress and artist. A lesser known aspect of Elk Sommer's life might surprise you despite her glamorous image on screen, she faced personal tragedies. In the early 1970s, she experienced the heartbreaking loss of her husband, Joe Hyams, in a tragic accident. 
This event deeply affected her, marking a sad chapter in her otherwise lively life. Hailing from Germany, Elk Somber began her acting career in the late 1950s, gaining recognition for her talent and beauty. She starred in numerous films throughout the 1960s and 1970s, charming audiences with her versatility. Despite her success in Hollywood, she never forgot her German roots, often returning for various projects and events. Throughout her career, Elk Somber displayed a notable ability to adapt to different roles, showcasing her versatility as an actress. From comedies to dramas, she brought characters to life on screen, earning the admiration of fans worldwide. Besides acting, Elk Somber explored other interests like painting and writing. Her creative pursuits allowed her to express herself in new and meaningful ways, further enriching her impact in the entertainment industry. Despite facing personal challenges, her passion for her craft never waned. She continued to grace the screen, leaving her lasting imprint on cinema that still connects with audiences today. In conclusion, Elk Sommer's life had its share of ups and downs, but her talent and resilience ensured her enduring legacy as a beloved actress and cultural icon.